Welcome back everyone and I'm so happy to see you here after you listened the first part of my story in a previous video. Uh, so in this one I want to do something different. I want to show you my process of training which I started a few days ago um, and this process um, includes some training in the gym um, and some specific exercises I'm trying to search off uh, for prepare my body um, for figure skating, adult figure skating. Um, and uh, I think it, it would be interesting for myself in a few years to see this journey and maybe for some of you too. So first part of this video will be exactly about that. Let's go. No, that is what they all say when they see me pouring some wine. Oh, oh, then gets empty again. But I fill it up for I go. Cause I'm loving it, feeling it, touch me and being it. See what I see in it. I'm typical, messing around with it, mix it up, go with it, fuck with it, flow with it, let it all go. Oh, Lord, think you know what I'm like. But you don't fall, you lose control. So hot, I forgot what I should have thought of before Sure ain't easy for you to let off the rules Cause there's so much fun Are you loving the feeling that touch me? Are you in it? Don't see what you're seeing But the pickle, messing around with it Mix it up, go with it, fuck with it, flow with it Please let it go have a time on the treadmill in the end um, and today I just try to keep some some flexibility positions in which you are sometimes are turning and uh, skating um, I believe this one calls Billman and I surprised that my back is still capable of doing stuff like that because my back was pretty flexible in uh, ballet, I made it flexible. Uh, but after a pose when I didn't do anything uh, for one year and two months, I barely could bend myself just a little bit backwards. Uh, so yeah. I still think that <laughs> I can do something and even this backside bend in this position is more difficult for me than the Billman one uh, but I just started and I'm so excited and yeah I will work and hopefully you will see those elements of mine on ice fingers crossed how does it feel to breathe when you take coming back from the gym and uh, during my treadmill time I was watching uh, Ekaterina Gordeva and Sergei Grinkov program uh, from Olympics 1994 uh, this is one of my favorite pair couples pair skaters ever and uh, what they made on ice is just pure magic and if you are a fan of figure skating but didn't see them and didn't know their story please watch them out and yeah it's a tragic in the end but it's so beautiful how sad how does it feel to breathe when you're dead they never seen you out of your bed cut to the bone it's broken up bed I'm a 
bit out of my breath. Uh, we are on our way to have a workout with my husband um, in the gym, but I decided to do a 15 minute cardio and a 10 minute ab workout and 10 minute stretching before, before I did that and I'm all wet and already done, but we are going to do more. I come alive with me and quit the jealousy. I know you're bored. I know it's boring me. I come alive, baby. Get out the grave with me. I know you're bored. How does it feel to breathe when you're dead? They never seen you out of your. So, what was that all about? It was all about trying to keep uh, the layback spin and building kind of a building position on this half. Actually, I'm not sure how this is like officially called um, sphere, half sphere. And I used to work on it a lot with uh, my trainer Ola uh, back in gym in Russia, and we did a great stuff in it, so I'm excited to come back to this workout, but not as a belly dancer, but as a kind of <laughs> uh, old figure skater. You're not old. <laughs> Cut to the bone is broken up, but how sad. If you ever wondered how the face of a person who is sitting in a middle split and stretching himself, herself, uh, looks like. Uh, my middle splits sucked uh, since Vaganova days and uh, they were one of my most unfavorite things to do ever because I have tight hips uh, and my inner thighs were never that flexible and I literally remember how I was crying my eyes out to trying to be like as flexible as Vaganova asks you to be uh, so here I am again now but of course I'm not pushing myself like too too hard I think so Okay, it's 9.18 p.m. and I'm totally done for today. So guys, I was talking about a health issue and what is it? I have a knee arthrosis in my left knee joint. Uh, so yeah, it's kind of painful and uh, usually hyaluronic acid shots help me But here in the United States, I can get a shot I need because of the, all the difficulties with the health insurances um, I will talk about it um, more in details uh, in a separate video um, That's what I'm doing before practice. It's a freeze roller and That's great that it's vegan vegan mm -hmm. and I just apply it on knee all over kind of late night session um, it's 8 30 p.m. I believe and um, tomorrow morning I will watch worlds will keep my fingers crossed for all athletes and can wait to see who will win uh, but tomorrow it's just the first day and today I'm gonna my practice.